doesn't save anybody. That's a false doctrine. People believe on Christ in their heart. That's what makes them a believer. With the heart, man believes in the righteousness. With the mouth, confession is made in the salvation. Baptism is obedient to the command of Christ. Go into all the world and preach the gospel, baptizing them in the name of the Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit. So this is what we're doing out of obedience of Christ. Baptism is said to be an answer to a good conscience towards God. So something happened in the little heart of Caleb, it happened to me, if you're saved, it happened to you. And when you get baptized, you're expressing that publicly to others that you want to follow Christ and live for him the rest of your days. And that's what little Caleb understands and wants to at this time. So we're going to baptize him according to scripture. So put your hands together like that. Can you put your hands together like that? Then I'm going to do that. Him and mom have been practicing. <laughs> So, Caleb, I baptize you, my brother, in the name of the Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit, buried in his likeness, made to walk in newness of Christ Jesus. son, Stephen, he's going to be 40. Wow. In the 40th February, he got saved at a young age. and we were I was, I was pastoring in Georgia at the time I was in Bible college. And uh, we, got, uh, we got him baptized in a fish hatchery. So they didn't have a baptistry in the church, so a bunch of people were with us, and I baptized him. But I was nervous because there was a uh, a, a snake in the water working around over here and in my mind I was certain it was a mo moccasin I was just certain of it and it wasn't but I thought it was and I was very nervous not about baptizing my son about that stinking snake <laughs> no, but he was young uh, some of your children are going to make professions some of them will maybe doubt it later I'm, I'm more excited about some that want to get saved and want to get baptized. I let God deal with all that other stuff. Amen. And I've known many people get saved at a very young age. I know pastors that were saved at five years old uh, pastoring today. So rejoice with this little one and this mother. They're going to come out soon. If some will hang around, we want to congratulate them, welcome them to the church as a new family. Okay? Let's close in a word of prayer.